The 49ers just waived undrafted rookie free agent guard Jason Poe, who I think is one of the best offensive linemen on the team. This doesn't mean the Niners don't like him. I think they like him very much. This merely means that they think no one else knows about him and that they can that he'll clear waivers and uh, end up on the 49ers practice squad. And he just may. And he freaking better the way I look at it because what a shame it would be if they lost this guy. Again, I think the Niners think he's their secret. Undrafted rookie free agent from a very small school, Mercer. I don't even know where Mercer is. Never heard of it before Jason Poe came along. They're probably thinking, why would any team put him on their 53-man roster when no other team even wanted to draft him? That's sound logic, and it's probably correct. Um, that's probably also why the Niners didn't play Jason Poe with the starters in that final preseason game. I think they were trying to have him fly under the radar. It's also why the Niners didn't want us beat writers reporting that Jason Poe was playing with the starters in camp, um, which he was. And it's why when KNBR's Jake Hutchinson asked Kyle Shanahan about Jason Poe getting reps with the starters in camp, Kyle Shanahan gave him the death stare and was like, I don't know about that. You know, players rotate all the time. So yeah, Niners like Poe, um, other teams out there. I don't do quality control for other teams, but if you're looking for a guard, you might want to take a look at Jason Poe. No, I'm not trying to have... Uh, Poe get poached, but I'm really not married to the 49ers like that. This is a risky move. And if they cut Poe so they could keep someone like Nate Sudfeld, shame on the 49ers. Anyway, I hope the Niners keep Jason Poe. He just might be their starting left guard this year pretty soon.